Ooh, that's scary. Ah, that's even scarier. I am Bruh. not a liar. I have killed thousands. Okay. I have fed more drug fiends than the top three pharmaceutical companies combined. Okay, that's pretty I have stolen children from parents, wives from husbands, wiped out entire generations. Why would you do that? But lying, that I have never done. The rest are offenses against humanity. Lying is an offense against yourself. I am the head of the Santa Blanca organization. Am I supposed to look up to you? What you call a cartel. Boo, cartels, I boo! Dream. I dreamed of a land where we could grow our own coca, produce our own cocaine, where we could run our business free from interference from the police, the government, the army, the Yankees. In my the dreams, a woman's voice asked me, Sueño, mijo, what if you had your own country? Like Moses. Was that your mom? I led my people to the promised land, Olivia. This dude has a cross we on his here. face. We bought the coca fields. What we couldn't buy, we took. We bought the police, the military, the judges, the politicians. We were on the verge of becoming the government itself. On the razor's edge from fulfilling my dream. Dude, it's an angel. It's like an angel of death. Of creating an narcos. Is that what you are? Angel of death? The nation of Santa Blanca. Ooh, ominous. When we're done with you. You won't be the leader anymore. Last week, a crude explosive detonated outside the U.S. Embassy in La Paz, Bolivia. Two Marine Embassy guards were injured in the blast. Two days later, a CIA asset in central Bolivia provided us with these images. Oh, that's not Our good. analysts have identified the individual in the photo as DEA Special Agent Ricardo Ricky Sandoval, my friend. Ricky! had spent the last six years investigating the local cocaine industry. Our understanding is that Sandoval was the intended target of the bombing. What the embassy bomb did not accomplish was completed up close and personal. Sandoval was captured, tortured, and killed. Oh, then no. his body was dumped. We have yet to recover it. Our target, the group responsible for the embassy bombing and the death of Special Agent Sandoval, is the drug trafficking organization commonly known as the Santa Blanca Cartel. Yesterday, they were just narcos. Today, they're narco-terrorists. Initially, the Bolivian government resisted the Mexican cartel. They formed UNIDAD, a Bolivian special forces unit. It didn't go as planned. Thousands of bodies later, politicians, police officers, and journalists have become an endangered species. That's why politicians suck. The Bolivian government has imploded on itself. With really? other options, the new president made a deal with Santa Blanca. You stop killing our people, we'll look the other way. What? Since then, Santa Blanca has turned Bolivia into the nexus of the South American drug trade. With their friends in Mexico, they also have a clear pipeline to the U.S. and Canada. The only way to stop Santa Blanca for good is shoot to him in the head. completely dismantle them, piece oh. by piece. Can we just shoot him in the head? Organized into four operations. Production. Smuggling. Uh -huh. Security and Word. influence. Uh huh. At the top of it all is El Jefe de los Jefes, boss of bosses. El Jefe. El Sueño. El Sueño. I'm gonna put a bullet to his head. Well, ladies and gentlemen, as you can see, we are going to start playing. Ghost Recon Wildlands. It's actually a pretty fun game. You get a ride around. You pretty much do exactly what you want to do in the game. You proceed exactly how you want to. So it's really great. Uh, it's a really great game in that way. So what I'm going to end up doing is making my character, and then once my the rest of my team is gathered, we're actually going to go ahead and start our first mission. But until then, 
It'll be a gambler sign out.